guys welcome back to this channel if you're new to this channel please consider subscribing support this channel by subscribing we are still looking at oman and we are still looking at the labor laws the visas sections in oman one asked the question how many days can we stay in oman after the visa expiry sometimes we call it overstay but remember before we talk about how many days there are three things we need to consider First, we look at a person who has come on a visa visa. Then two, we shall look at a person who has a residence visa or what we call residence permit. Then also three, we shall look at what are the uh, what are the penalties for overstaying. Yes, a person on, a, on any visa who overstays, for example, visa visa, who overstays in Oman, is only given 24 hours to leave the country. Hope that is very clear. A person on a visa overstays allowed a period of an excess of 24 hours from the date of the visa expiry. That is if you are on what you call a visa visa. If you are on a visa visa, you are only given an excess of 24 hours to leave the country. Or otherwise, you are going to pay what you call penalties. And remember, in these Gulf countries, overstay penalties are counted every single day that you stay in that country. So you must be very careful with that. Then let us try to look at a person who has what we call a residence visa or a person who, has, who holds what we call a residence permit. You might have been working in that country, yeah. But again, remember, you've resigned, you've terminated yourself or you've been terminated by the country, uh, by the employer. How many days are you supposed to stay in that country? Or how many days are you supposed to stay in Oman before, you, they, before, you can, you, before they can give you penalties? So remember, a person on any residence visa overstays is allowed a period of an excess of 30 days from the date of your visa expiry. For example, if you had your contract with that company and it's running for two years, and you decide not to renew your contract with your employer. You are only given 30 days to leave the country. Remember, we talked about the termination. You can either resign or you can either resign from your employer even if it is on a probation period. But if you're ready, you've served your contract and you wish not to, to, to continue with that employer and you wish to go out of your country or to go out of command, you are only given an excess of only 30 days to exit the country. Otherwise, if you don't do so, then you'll have what you call the penalties. You'll be charged with penalties. That is if you have what you call a residence visa or what you call a residence permit. Remember, all these Gulf countries have their own requirement for overstay and they have their own charges for overstay at that time. So in situation two, let us try to look at what happens, what are the charges if you overstay in Oman, in case your visa expire, expires, or in case your residence permit expires in Oman. How much are you charged per every single day that you get to spend in that country? That is exactly what we want to look at. Remember, we looked at a person who is on a visa visa, then we look at a person who has a residence permit. But now let us look at the charges that you are supposed to pay when you overstay in Oman. Remember, remember, in Oman, you are supposed to pay an equivalent, that is an equivalent of 10 Oman real every single day that you stay in that country. Remember, before the charges, we are 25 Oman real for a person overstaying in that country. Then it was amended to 10 real, to 10 Oman real. Why? Why was this done? It was amended in such a way not to discourage the tourists coming in Moscow or coming to visit Oman. So hope I'm very clear and hope you've tried to get it for a person who's planning to go there to either look for job or this visa of anything you probably know what you are supposed to do thank you so much for coming back to this channel 
Thank you so much for tuning. Support this channel by subscribing as we try to see, as we try to learn more interesting uh, information or to get more information uh, about these Gulf countries where we come to look for greener pastures or where people come to look for greener pastures in any way or the other. Thank you so much. See you again in the next video.